Welcome to today's Open Gate show for Sunday the Limerick's car, April 30th. DK water provides much needed oxygen to the entire body. Our brain needs water. DK water aids in good digestion and, and helps us maintain a healthy way. DK water doesn't taste flat or boiled. It makes for an excellent drinking experience and has a pH of 7.5. Located 2 Greece Road, Kingston 6, Unit 3A, close to the Mountain View and Auto Wind Supply near the National Stadium, adjacent to Robertson Avenue. Call them 876 627 91145, 876 627 91145, or 876 807. 5316-876-807-5316 Their website, destination, kingston876.com Check their website. There are other things that are of great interest other than DK Water. Go spend quality time at Super Hill Bar, 14 Kentucky Plaza, Hayes, Clarendon. Easily seen off the main road. Safe, secure, super atmosphere, courteous staff, and tasty cuisine cooked by order. Join the movement and start your presence for the future. Truly a great place to be. Before I get to tomorrow's great card, I must make a comment on what I have observed in recent weeks. The Supreme Franchise Racing Entertainment Limited, when they, well, two years, a year and a half ago, there were lots of complaints and about various aspects and how they were dealing with the, the racing complex. I was one who criticized them, and I must say that I now realize you to getting information and understanding what is taking place, that horse racing in Jamaica in short time will be something great, even competing with those race tracks at the United States. The tour board will be, in effect, I would say maybe another month and a half and the latest, and you're going to see a lot of benefits of horse racing. We need more horses better trainers, better jockeys, and surely our fans will be enthused and all the betting that the big venture racing the team limited will be offering. The first race tomorrow uh, starts at approximately 11.25 a.m. and they go 1100 meters or 5.5 furlongs. This race is named in, named in honor of Dr. John Matheson, O.D. Surely, all who was tutored by this great horseman will remember a lot from what he taught. He had a family of uh, horse racing people. His daughter was a top polo player, and I'm sure she's still dealing with horses. This race is for me about four years and up. It's a maiden condition race. And it starts the monetary appeal with a carryover of six point eight plus million dollars. Number one, Canon John gets a bit of injuries and it cost him the race uh, on last, that was on the 18th of April, going six for round when he finished second. Two for the World Veterinarian Weekend. This race is named in honor of Dr. Grace McDonald Lyon, OD. Don't know much about her, but surely any veterinarian uh, should be applauded because it's not an easy job and it takes a lot of time, patience, and a, and a sports experience. This race goes six for over 1200 meters before choosing up. It's a claiming rate six hundred to seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Seven declared. Number two, Sunshine Cat, paper light, 
and the profitability that this was, well, it's not a tri super factor race, it's a trifactor. I uh, don't see this one getting into the lower exotics, but you never know. On the street, the Lambaba, Mamba rather, returns off a soldier of well trade, adores running off a layoff, get the top type back on, of which he presses. It all adds up to big pluses, don't you think? Lala Lambamba should have a decent shot if they are posted it. Number seven, Ben Street sales. Number four, Azaria has to be considered, even though up against uh, two top opponents in number three, Lala Bamba and number seven, Ben Street. Number five, Cartel has only been at six for long once in ages. Trainer Ryan Darby excels at claiming horses, but I think he, he ain't as was in the last season that character race. Number five, number six, there is a light one very easily at 19 to 1 for Trader Darby against a suspected set who were not as good as these here. Number seven, Dell Street won fighting almost a month ago at this distance on the 2nd of April going uh, at 85 favorite day next and fought all the way from Fertile Point to last by ahead, meeting Troll Sky and T. Brady in a time of 1.13 and 4.5. His back class says a lot, plus he is one, plus he's on a fast track, galloping. These claiming races can be tricky at times, as well as the, the, the Antipo favorites have just run away with so be careful. My selection in order, number seven, Dead Street, number three, La La Bamba, number four, Azaria, number five, Carter. Third race for me, about four of them, restricted mid condition race, going 800 meters straight, 13 declared. Number two, Premier Identity, get first and blinkers, of which she has been looking a bit better in that equipment in the mornings. Let's see what. How to transform in the race tomorrow. And the three magic boy, another who is coming off a high toss, but really looking at a change of horse. Uh, look, looking to be the low speed in this race. And um, the change of stable seemingly has done this horse wonders. Nothing taken nothing take from Chain of Murray. But sometimes a chain of thought does a great, a great, a great, makes a great difference. Number five, Sergeant Charge, uh, very light coming off a respite. I will wait on this one for a top two places. Number six, Lady Ben. Family new jockey, Omar Simpson, was a the last twice. And now taking first days up for Michael Mao. Number seven, Risky Baby, run okay enough to be part of the top four if, get if top four in this race, if um, he can improve the display on the 18th of April, four and a half for him straight with Natalie Berger. This horse ran evenly and finished six, two and a half left behind Josh De Gaulle and, and company. Just to figure eight. And a positive change of rider, but ran poor last week and had some amends to, to make up. Number nine, Red Rain, good size troll, whose three career starts showed nothing. Gallop seven days after this horse was declared lame on the 18th of April, and the late starter from that race. Won, uh, back to Omar Walker, let's see how great. This win can be. Number 10, select me one of two here for Patrick Lynch. This one will be getting blinkers off and may prove her name correct in obtaining a top five spot. Number 11, Ellie 29, best order or best run so far from six career starts with the straight on the 1st of January. Uh, an 8 to 1 uh, odds that 
he, well, it showed the confidence that he had. He ran evenly. To be fifth five on the ball is the author which Babylon will and Prince 57 kilos though, allowing others in this race is a hurdle. And the 12 medical bomb, the other Patrick Finch holds there, but the one has to, this one has three current starts, all in April. This trainer has already dropped numerous bombs in the past, and his bomb is loaded with missiles. Number three though, Magnus Boyle, took the 12 meter bomb, number seven, Risky Bid, number nine, Great Wayne, number 10, Select Me. Four Drakes have eight horses declared, 40 of the meters or seven from Fort Lady Wayne, five of them up, who was number one, two races as well as eight points, five of them up, who remains a maiden. Number two, when they're in Texas, only has to break better from the gates to play a role in the top three. Take your chances, it's yours. <laughs> Number three, Bin Laden, they're out of Southern and training for quite a while. He ran well on debut, so he won't be perturbed by this layoff. I must point out though that he didn't run against much in all four career starts, so although Bin Laden was a fair one, he doesn't necessarily be scary much. Uh, of these opponents, especially number six, Commandant Luna and number eight, Dodger Slink. But we will see. Number six, Commandant Luna, close by the last and could be a dangerous one. Once again, that was the 17th of April, going five from Rome and finished second, three quarter length behind Kwana and had Dodger Slink a short head behind. Uh, it's better off at the Anikos this time against number eight Dodger Flink, who have been fairly consistent in the last four starts and well supported on the board. Has worked in on um, has worked intensely for the first time since returning after the long layoff on Saturday the twenty third when when strode central one thirty seven and three fifth looking easily and that signal signals a lot. The third bomb is woefully off form of late. Let's see if the doctors they can dot this link and get rid of the poor display with your horses. Number six, Commander Angeluna, from number eight, Dr. Slink, number three, Milan, number two, Adore Brilliant. Before I get to race five, DK Water provides much needed oxygen to the entire body. Our brain needs water. DK Water aids in good digestion, helps us maintain a healthy weight. DK water doesn't taste flat or boiled. It makes for an excellent drinking experience and has a pH of 7.5. Located at Tokyo Road, Kingston 6, Unit 3, close to the Mountain View and Arterwick stoplight near the National Stadium, almost adjacent to Robertson Avenue. Call 876 627 That's 876 or 876-807-5316, that's 807-5316, and go to your website, destination kingston876.com. Check this website. Oh, it has other things of interest that I'm sure you'd like. Go spend quality time at Super Bar, 14 Kentucky Plaza, Hayes Garden, easily seen off the main road, safe, secure, super atmosphere, courteous staff, and tasty cuisine. Hope to order. Join the movement. Start your presence for the future. Truly a great place to be. The Open Show will likely be there next week for an exclusive special preview and horse racing where I'll have Dennis Harrison and another of which, of which we will be discussing to make a horse racing. Don't miss it. Remember to tell your friends to subscribe on YouTube to the Open Gate Show. Race 5, 5 from Australia, 1000 meters straight. 10 declared before 4 is up, who will never want to race this is the point of 4 is up, who remains a maiden. This is section 1. Number 1, Justin Blessing has steel in the Cardenas, two dangerous assets. Number 4, Barton Star, no one has a port, well that's iffy. Um, well, he has a good 
apprentice who does well on the straight in Matthew Bennett. So, for those who play the exotics, could have this one in your lower order. Number five, Queen Zan has to improve surely in order to win. Uh, I saw this one uh, going to the pool this week and it means he ain't all that hundred. However, she is a good looker and could get on the board seeing there's no word be to hear. In the sixth on Chico, yet to run a bad race on the straight. We'll have first time figure it on. Let's see what that does. Number seven, audibility, a debit of the US bred five year old Bay Mayor by an audible by Manifee. Brent, oh sorry, own of Brendan Farm train with someone Williams, Stacey Guy, Brent is also in the United States, Robert Brown Goon, and Natalie Bird arrived. Audibility is surely not to decide to be considered for a top five slot. Just by the basic for the first time after failing to run on numerous occasions. Number 18 is a count should be part of the top four as a fair consistency is there for you to agree with me. Number nine, traditional boy. Had seen an apprentice, not to the Berger on the last twice. Now that's the champion jockey, Anthony Thomas. He ran well last week, 20th of April, when someone had followed at 88 to 1, ran evenly. And for the sun, five minutes behind Amron, Whitman Biden, San Salano. Number 10, I heard of a lion. It's here for you, not really me. For a win, but come to think of it, he was declared a late on the 23rd of, sorry, yes, on the 23rd of April. But came back to the race track the following day and got three for the 37th and two feet. So maybe whatever issue that he had, it was minor. Answer to number one, Justin Blessing. Possibly two or lost number nine, traditional boy. Number ten, Heart of a Lion. Number five, Queen Zan. Number eight, Team of the Count. Race six goes up with five from straight course again, but this has 15 horses declared, so five is not the claiming race. Only in 50,000 and nearly about 6 years up was number one. Two races as well as nearly about 6 years up who remains in Maiden. 12 year old Sir Frederick, that's number one, didn't win, didn't won like a 2 to 5 favourite on last on the 12th of April, going 4 for the straight, not to fight all the way uh, to hold off, time to say goodbye. Uh, and from this inner draw, so Frederick has it all to do. Number two, radical, a double claim, but last three, st three stars left a lot to be desired. Number three, part of Princess could get a place on the board, as I saw this one on Tuesday, 26th of April. Canton on the straight. And she looks fairly well. And of course, and to the Subrati, he take no chances with this trainer, with these claiming horses. Number five, dance all night, 50 kilos, and Omar Walker, he remains, he rode his horse at last, the city of April, going four for the straight at six to one, and for the fifth, final three quarter length, behind the book, Pacman had it best. Uh, this horse has never run well in the figure eight, and that's often, and you know, I'm expecting a, 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 a competitive effort from this one to get into the top four. My seven poker star reared at the gate last time on the 17th of April, finishing third, six and a half, and that was that. Even though 10 year old had back class and could be cool. Number eight, explosive charge. He was okay, <coughs> pardon me, especially on the straight. Even with 57 kilos, could use fitness and get in the top five. In the 13 final bullets, surround the expectations. On the 9th of April, going far from Rome, when claimed for that race. 
and finish eight, fifteen and three quarter length, then add up black world and fall in forever. <coughs> Sorry. Before that, one in a fight and finish, what was disqualified, that was on the 12th of March, going fight for a ground, 57 kilos with Andre Thomas, won by, well, won by a head. Or I should say, deleted with 1400. And uh, um, now gets his rider and should fight for club honors. The odds he got at the last 6 to 1 wasn't intriguing, and the chances are the fight work wasn't well. Let's see what happens tomorrow. No 14 head, Mary, the added firm should be, uh, be welcoming. No 15 small screen, well drawn, and based on his last two starts. Should have to say. Number seven, though, and that's Focus Star. From number five, Downfall Knight. Number 13, Flying Bullet. Number 15, Small Screen. Number 14, Hail Mary. Race seven, section two. For the game, but four is not one, two races with imported four is not who are still made. Ten to clear for the section. Five for them straight again, or a thousand meters straight. The two sons allow quickly back from last week. Race where he ran very well with seven and a half furlongs and led, but weakened a bit to be third, two and a half lengths than Orban and Bimin Biden. High speed, uh, which is a huge asset of the straight course. Number four, a tournament who did not ignore the first. She never performed well in the figure eight, and that was on the last. Five times she raced. It's off now, and I'm expecting a good show tomorrow. Number five, legal opportunity. He could earn a result of spot. Number seven, ladies and gold. Decent chance to have a run on the 30th of January of his course at 38 to 1. Finished fourth, three and a half lengths in 58 and 350 behind King Ring Charmer and Jackson Blessing. That surely says a lot. Number 10, Chubavano, well drawn and has speed, plus the car Davis. That's my selection. Chubavano to hold on this time from number 4, Atonement, number 7, Ladies in Gold, number 3, Slam Silano, number 5, that's legal opportunity. Race 8, it's for Netherlands Foils and Important Foils up with number 1, 3 races. Well, maybe we had four holes of number one for it. They go mile of 600 meters, eight, declared number one classical arm, very consistent with in Porti, who has to be respected if decided connections allow this one to come off the pace. And the two of sky will be up in the in the pace and has shown she can quicken up the lane as yet. Number three, Prince Marshall, one like a favorite, and last, the turn of the two turns, 925 yards, pulled away to win, to win by four and a half length. Okay, time of 158, flat, beat in mind of Cat and Heaven with Glitter, working okay. And this one, because he can quicken up the straight, should be afforded with a decent chance to get into the top five. Number four, Rick Charmer, sketching out to a mile now. Number five, T. Brady, fits well with these. Number six, Amur Boss. Speedy Sword, who has changed stable since that last race on the 28th of, 26th of December, rather, and uh, will be making its season debut. Will contest the pace, but the last is my issue with this one. Number seven, Burn Notice, nicely not the handicaps here yeah, and should be part of the outcome. Number eight, still made Santorini. We'll have a good pace to, to chase. One of these in order for me, number eight, Santorini, number five, T. Brady, number seven, Burn Notice, number one, Classical Orb, number three, Prince Marshall. Ninth race goes six for over 200 meters for little bit five and up, who's number one for races as well as imported five and up, who has only one two races. 30 declared, number one, take two. Plus 6.5 kilos for Omar Walker. Mm. Number four, Kirby Tan, born on the curve with Anthony Thomas. That's a lot of confidence for a connection. See that this horse sprints a lot and 
Sandra was born on the planet. We found that this part of our here in this class for a while, so he has to be given a good chance. See, he is very versatile in that he can be on the lead, be off the pace. So that's an asset in this field. Number eight, Cole Pursuit has a heavy campaign last season. And uh, only had three starts early in 2022. And back here, we don't much, well, we don't much work on the first track. I am bypassing this one, at least for the win. When I called the RS speed and the car is really doing well. The, the, the collections of this horse since at this table. The return to fresh cash bounced about the last four and a half and last when coming off a long sojourn, fitting now but 3.5 kilos overweight for Robert Allen. Oh jeez, you know, these overweight are getting to be a lot. It suggests that we don't have much junkies here. Or what does it suggest in your opinion? Anyway, fresh cash has back class and surely there was to be. So number 13, fresh cash for number 5. That is fun. Number nine, Colbert. Number four, that's Colby Tan. Number eight, that's Cole Pursuit. The penultimate race, race 10. This is the World Veterinary Day trophy. And as I mentioned earlier, veterinarians uh, are not a plenty. They work very hard, ridiculously hard. And we must always applaud them. One mile they go, and this is the future race of 1600 meters. Nine were declared. Number two, three, Atlantic Blue may get an exotic spot, seeing that he worked okay. And that's the best I've seen him for a while. That was on Sunday, the 24th of April. Gallup in 6th, on the 26th and the 5th. Number four, Gambler could an exotic spot. Number seven, Royal Liquid, very fit horse and will be part of the top five, surely. And then I am afraid he has this played at last, that he is in good shape. The agent of April Brown's farm last found a 24 to 157 kilos, up a bit with the lead, and ended up a length and a half third in that farm last for the sprint race, that farm at time of 105 and 350. Well, the US imported when we had one beating Mohammed in three quarters of length and had and for three quarters of length. Surely was pencil for this race, this I am Fred. Number nine, current affair. Uh, can't see how number eight, I am Fred, better than with 50 kilos on the 18th of April. And currently, fair 54 kilos. And now, number eight, I am Fred, is almost in love with his horse. This is a complete joke. And you know, well, anyway, let's move on. Should be a two or three race between number eight, I am Fred, and current affair. And surely, number eight, I am Fred, gets the edge based on the last run. And at the handicaps, number nine comes the fair in second for me, number seven or liquid for third, and for fourth, number four gamble to get the better of the three Atlantic Group Five Minor. Final race, race eleven shows an option, optional table race, three hundred to four hundred thousand, and nearly about six hundred thousand for number one four races. Number four turned the strike, right okay and laugh. Looked challenging at the final point, but flattened to be third, three and a half lengths to it Ricardo and Jason Oro. Will set for long on the 16th of April. Should be fitting now. And the champion jockey and the Thomas Street to ride. Number five, Prince Dominique could grow for a share. Number six, Sunny. Better the number of the top ones here easily on the 27th of March. Going a mile with Dave Nelson uh, held off the pace and when Arts pulled away to be nine and a quarter length in front of Manon Ruth and Nalas Bushman. Number seven on ice should, should do well. Uh, she looked okay when I saw her in the morning. 
So we turn back to Gray, running the world of late, and with him, with the key of this, then the build. Uh,